I mean, if we're going la that route and the superficial route, lingerie is always good. So Julianne, this was such a complex role and you nailed it. Oh, thank you very much. Tell me about making the movie. Uh, it was probably the most fun I've ever had on any project. I really? mean, this was, it was so freeing. I felt so myself, like, with all of these people around, and I felt like I could be vulnerable and, and never feel exposed or, or threatened, you know? And, um, but it was, it was a, it was a hard thing to do, you know? There's a lot of responsibility, um, to, to do it justice, you know? I mean, the, the issues that Katie deals with at the beginning of the film and throughout the film, um, unfortunately, it happens more than we want to, to know, right. you know. Um, it's a delicate Yeah, it's a delicate issue, with. yeah. So, you know, but at the end of the day, the goal is to, to, to let the audiences know that, you know, everybody deserves a second chance and everybody deserves love and happiness and, and you really can find it. So. And you will find it. And you will find it. I love You know it when you find yeah. it. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> now, you said it was one of your most fun movies to make. Yes. Really? Compared to all the dancing and singing you've done on other ones? Yeah, you know, because I like a challenge. Not just right. to say that those weren't challenging. They definitely were, but in different ways. Like, this was such a, a challenging movie where... It wasn't physical. It was all, you know, um, mental and emotional. And so, um, preparing for something like that, you you dig deep into f kind of finding new things about yourself out. So yeah, it's you fun know, to be challenged. Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> so you and Josh were just so hot together in this movie. I mean, the tree scene. I just died. That was, oh, good. That was like one of the hottest scenes I've seen in a while. Wow. What thank was it you. like making that? Is that awkward at first? Like. How do you start? Yeah, I mean that was that was close to the beginning of us shooting together. So it was the first time we kissed. Um, oh really? Uh, yeah, that was our first kiss, and so it was kind of good because we were both kind of like nervous about it. Even though like this is our job, it's still not like comfortable, right? <laughs> you know, um, like, this is not my boyfriend. We're just yeah, make out. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, but even if it like. Even if I didn't have a boyfriend and he didn't, whatever, and doing still, that, it's still nerve wracking, yeah. <laughs> you know, like. Um, anyways, but it ended up working out yeah. pretty well. So. It looked it looked really good. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. Um, so this comes out on Valentine's Day. Tell me yes. what your best or possibly worst Valentine's Day ever was. Um, my best. Um, I'm gonna have to go back to third grade. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that long ago? <laughs> when Jackson, um, when he got me a necklace that was made out of candy. The way to my Aww. heart is jewelry and candy. Candy, okay. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, but that's really, it's funny, because now that this is coming out on Valentine's Day, I've been right. thinking about that kind of stuff, and it's cute. I don't know, I mean, honestly, I, to me, I just like a low-key Valentine's Day. I'm not one of those girls that's like, oh, another reason to, to it should be every day. <laughs> but um, but no, like I just like low-key kind of, Okay. you know, write me a letter. I like that. What do you think you should do for a guy? Do you get a guy gifts? What I would mean, your recommendation be? I mean, if we're going la that route and the superficial route, lingerie is always good. Lingerie. <laughs> You're like, he doesn't need a watch. He'd rather than see this. Okay. Yeah. Now, but again, like, I, I mean, I'm with somebody who would like a letter as well, you know, saying the reasons nice why. Yeah. <laughs>